very much. Um, I love my job. I love being here and being able to see people like Gloria Gaynor, who you grew up with, and I'm that was she. All my mother used to play all of her music. You know, you have just inspired me. Your song is my karaoke, <laughs> always, <laughs> always. But it has got me through life. So thank you. Thank I'm very you. excited that you are here. I'm so, oh, I'm so honored. <laughs> So I gotta go back downstairs. You know, I'm loving on both of y'all. I love y'all the life. Love you too. Y'all yeah. too. But I'm so honored you are here. Oh my gosh. It is, we're gonna have a good time. Y'all have to see the documentary. I know it's, uh, you gotta go to the theaters, but it is absolutely amazing of what she went through uh, before she even got that song and how she, she they gave her a Grammy for best disco album and they never even had that category. And they gave it to her and then when she went through, when everybody went through that anti-disco, disco sucks, like how her career was pretty much, she thought it was over. And then she had this husband who was just horrible to her. It, it, but the her triumph and her faith and how God just took her through and blessed her. Yeah. And some, I cried through the whole documentary. It was so damn good. Well, I just met Sherry and I am so excited now. To be, I mean, I was excited before, but now I'm like over the moon excited to be, that's a British statement, isn't it? To be on the show <laughs> because she is fabulous. I have loved her forever. She she said that your song is her karaoke song. Mm -hmm. Do you have a karaoke song? That's my karaoke song. <laughs> that, that, that would be it. <laughs> and then stuff happens on the thing. You know, you have questions that, that are that are on the card that you're supposed to ask the guests, and they already know what you're going to ask them. So one of the questions, this, this cracked me up. One of the questions they told me, they said, Sherry, you're going to ask her, you're going to tell her that people mistake you for Octavia. And she's going to tell you that they mistake her, uh, Gloria Gaynor said, for uh, Diana Ross and like two Gladys other, like Knight. Gladys Knight. And it was, uh, so she had a whole list of, so I said, girl, you know, they mistake me for Octavia. It, did they mistake you for anybody? She goes, no. <laughs> Awesome, Sherry is everything I expected her to be. That infectious smile just opens you up and makes you tell it all. <laughs> Did you tell it all? <laughs> but you see, it moves. It moves very fast. They kept saying, "Sherry, go to the prompter to ask Katie Lee about you." But that damn ribeye was so good. <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm Katie Lee Beagle, and today we're making a great Valentine's Day meal. I'm making ribeyes with a red wine and mushroom, mushroom, mushroom glaze. <laughs> Why is that hard to say? I'm so excited to see Sherry. Because I, I do this intermittent fasting, so I stop eating after eight. I don't eat again until one o'clock. So I'm always, I was hungry, and I had one taste of that ribeye. I couldn't stop. I don't, I just, I was like, can I do the rest of the show with the ribeye? Oh, hello, this is a video. I'm posing for a picture. I had such a good time. I love Sherry. What a fun audience out there, too. Everybody's great. Happy Valentine's Day. And I want to give a shout out because she's filling in for our Marco G, who is usually in the audience. Marco G is not here today. But I'm going to tell you, our Joy has done a fantastic job. So She was always like, hey, Sherry, how's everything going? You're so sweet. And I was like, Joy is just the sweetest person. And we would go roller skating. And she was just like, you know, she was just like, how's everybody doing? Good morning. And then one time we all went out, because sometimes we'll hang out after the show. We all went out. And so uh, Joy has set up for us to go karaoke. But the place was not open. And so <laughs> she was mad. And this is when you see another side of me, because people come <laughs> Because of Sherry, so everybody has a certain weight in front of me. So she was on speaker. They had her on speaker to other employees, and she didn't know that I was sitting there. And it was like, Joy, and she was like, I ain't playing. These people ain't open up the place. I'm mad as a mother. I'm mad. This, this, this. And when I tell you, and she was like, these are your and this and this. And I, you know what? I ain't playing around with these people. I ain't playing around. And they go, Sherry's here. She was like, hey, Sherry, what are you doing? She turned it up. Yeah.
So that's, that's what I love, Joy, because Joy is like gangster. Y'all give me up for Sherry! That's what Joy. So y'all give it up for Joy, because I love her. I just noticed my high school teacher, Gail Smith, is in the audience. <laughs> but the first time I ever attended a live talk show in person, Gail took Miss Gail, because you know when you see your teacher, she right. called Miss yeah, yeah. Miss Smith took me to the, uh, the Rolando Watt show. Oh, and look at him now. Yeah. Running stuff. Did you ever think John Murray would be like a talk show executive? Like, you knew that way back then. And she had me selling them Otis Spunk Meyer cookies. <laughs> You have to fundraise for everything. And I want to remind you too, we got nominated for two NAACP images. <laughs> and if y'all wouldn't mind going to the, um, I don't even know what the website is. It's not ShowTV.com. Okay, you go to SherryShowTV.com and it'll click you over. So if you would vote for us, that would be really great. Thank you so much. All right, y'all, I just want to say God bless y'all. Thank you for coming. Please come back. We would love you to come back. Bring your mamas, your auntie, your cousins, your sorority sisters, all of them. Please come back. We love you. Thank you so much. We're gonna have a good